Hi, my name is Pat Woods. I'm the Director of Religious Education at Abraham Lincoln Unitarian Universalist Congregation in Springfield, Illinois. And I'm here today with you with the final Time for All Ages for 2020. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty doggone glad 2020 is over. But you know something else? At this time of the new year, I've always found this is a great opportunity to kind of look back and find those things that I did that I was pretty proud of and then maybe keep doing those and then take a look forward and find things that I haven't done that I think I'd like to do or would be pretty good for me and actually start doing those. And that's the challenge I'm gonna lay down for you now as we're looking forward into 2021. So as I look back in 2020, one of the things that I'm most proud of is the way that I stayed connected with people that I don't see very often. As a matter of fact, I was more connected with some of my extended family than I ever have been. And that was a side effect of COVID. We reached out to one another online. We met on Facebook. Yes, I'm that old, I Facebook. Sometimes Instagram, sometimes Snapchat, occasionally TikTok. But we were reaching out to one another. I even sent postcards and cards through snail mail to people. It was a lot of fun to buy stamps and know that I was sending mail to people. And I gotta tell you, it is such a delight to get a piece of mail from somebody. I think that's something I'm going to take forward into the new year. And the other thing I thought about was the thing I'd like to do going into the new year. That's something I've always wanted to do. And you know what it is? It's fencing. That's right. I remember when I was in high school many, many years ago, I took a fencing class. And I really enjoyed it. I don't know if I was any good at it or not. I just know we had to do the requirements, but I remember rather enjoying it. And as I was looking around for things that I can do in this new year that aren't going to cost me much money and would allow me to do things without getting together with large groups until we're all vaccinated, fencing seemed to be something pretty fabulous. So how about you? What are the things that you did last year that you're most proud of? And what are the things you want to keep doing into 2021? What's something new that you'd like to do in 2021? And then do it. Because after all, it's a new year, it's a new day, and it certainly is time to reinvent yourself. Have the happiest of new years, and I'll see you in 2021. Bye-bye.